I do want to take responsibility for my life, but sometimes other people do things that hurt you and, and change you. Well, unless you live in a glass bubble, getting hurt is part of living, even in here. I can't believe I was that girl a year and a half ago. I was feeling so secure and trustworthy and innocent. Maybe it would have been better if I hadn't left here. I mean, I felt so safe here. Well, that's not a good enough reason for you to choose to stay here. Convent life must be embraced with open arms. The way you embraced your future when you left us here. That was easy. I was so excited and thrilled to have a family who wanted me. Oh, I remember. And I remember thinking the time was right. Oh, you were so bright, so curious, so full of talent, and so lucky to have a family like Felicia and Lucas to care for you. I don't feel so lucky anymore. I kind of feel like I've betrayed everything that you taught me here. Everything? In a year and a half? I think maybe you tried to grab for too much too soon. That's what Felicia says, too. I guess I wanted it all. Well, we wouldn't give in to temptations if they played hard to get. Oh, but it's not just temptations. There's evil out there. And it's, it's awful. I mean, I never thought that it would touch me. But you mustn't let it touch your heart. You know, sometimes I think about... But maybe I inherited something bad from my father that would make me want... Make you want to what, dear? Well, I've, I've done some things that I'm ashamed of. And I've blamed someone else for them, but maybe I asked for it. Well, you have been tempted to grow away from the person you know best, yourself. I don't even know who that person is. You're going to college... Be a college girl. Have fun. And, and save that glittery showbiz world for later. When you'll know better how to separate the good guys from the bad. Hmm? 